I love a good layered look and in the past anytime I've attempted this I feel like the coat has sort of overtaken my outfit and the layered effect is lost so I wanted to show you how you could play around with layers and still allow that outfit to shine. I'm wearing a pleated maxi skirt from Balenciaga. This is an old one that I have in my collection. I usually dress it up but here I wanted to dress it down a little bit more. I'm pairing it with a white shirt that's very much giving old Celine vibes by Phoebe Philo. This one comes from a brand called LHAS. The coat is kind of giving totem vibes and this one is also from W Concept. It's faux shirling, it's very warm, it's also incredibly soft and I love how it layers with the white shirt, the maxi skirt and then these black ankle boots. The bag is from Maison Margiela and I wanted to tie in a little bit of a brown accent. Full leather piping around the jacket is brown so helps tie in all those warm tones into the black and white. So let's look at styling the same white shirt as before and the same jacket in a more casual manner. I'm saying casual, but it's still gonna be elevated. So this is something that you could wear to a family get together if you wanted to look a little bit more laid back. And it's something that you could wear into the office on a casual day. I just took a pair of oversized jeans, accessorized it with a long braided leather belt. I styled the look by draping the jacket over my shoulders, which is very simple and very chic. Of course, something that you can't really do if it's freezing outside. So it depends on the weather and where you live, of course. And then I just completed the look by styling it with a pair of black ankle boots. The black helps tie it back to the belt and it helps break up all of those colors as well because I have the blue from the jeans going on, the white from the top, and then the natural colors from the jacket. These little accents really help tie in the outfit and ground everything. You all know how much I love giving you versatile style options. So I'm gonna take the same base as before, the same white shirt, the same oversized jeans, same belt, same ankle boots. I'm just gonna swap out the coat with this really beautiful crop jacket featuring these big gold buttons. This jacket is so chic and it's giving Celine vibes by Edie Slimon. I think it's such a beautiful piece, something that can be dressed up with trousers, maybe even a pleated skirt if you're going into the office or if you have a family event, or you can dress it down and get a really beautiful casual chic moment. This is giving French girl vibes and I am obsessed. I'm totally here for this outfit. To complete the look, I styled it with my Le Mer egg bag. This one is one of my favorites in my entire collection and it's such a beautiful piece. I don't think it's available all the time, but if it is and you're contemplating picking it up, I would highly recommend it because it is such a showstopper of a piece. 24s.com is one of my favorite online retailers, especially when it comes to the space of luxury shopping. They're owned by LVMH and they stock brands like Louis Vuitton, Dior, Loewe, as well as Le Mer and Charlotte Chenet, which are some of my favorites. They're also having an incredible Black Friday sale right now. I was able to pick up this really beautiful Le Mer cardigan. It's my first piece of Le Mer ready to wear and I'm so excited to be adding it to my collection. I also picked up an ear cuff from Charlotte Chenet, who is a Parisian designer that I'm absolutely obsessed with. I recently got the small initial hoops from Charlotte Chenet, so adding the ear cuff to my collection just kind of completes everything. It's a really beautiful way to make a statement with my everyday jewelry and the quality of her designs are so beautiful. I'll leave the sweater and the ear cuff linked in the description box below, as well as a little discount code for an extra 10% off the sale items. I just want to say a big thank you to 24S for sponsoring this video. Make sure you check out their Black Friday sale. They are honestly one of my favorite online retailers. They have a really good curated selection of luxury and contemporary designers, so check them out. If you watch my channel regularly, then you know I'm a big fan of La Mer. I love the quality of their handbags. Like the leather that they use is so superb and it's so much better than a lot of the things that are out there right now, especially with the quality depleting on so many luxury brands. La Mer always brings it. They have these super cool silhouettes. Everything is very chic, very timeless. And that's what I like about it. If you've been sleeping on this brand, now is the time to pick up something from them. I got this sweater from 24S and it is a navy cardigan with a very relaxed, chill silhouette 
silhouette. It's very much giving French girl vibes and it's the silhouette that we all know and love from La Mer. I wanted to style this in a way that really allowed that sweater to shine. So I picked this pencil skirt from System. It's kind of got a wrap style and it's made out of 100% wool. So it just flows very beautifully and relaxed on the body. I went for a pair of tall boots from Meza Margiela and these are the tabby ones. They are so incredibly comfortable and I got these last year and I have been wearing them so much. I reached for a wool coat from W Concept. This one's made out of a wool and cashmere blend so you know that it's going to be a very timeless piece and something I'm going to have in my wardrobe for a long time. And then for the bag, I'm going for the La Mer large croissant bag. This is in the color Midnight Green and I never thought that I could pull off the large size of croissant, but after seeing it on a girl in Paris, I realized that yes, petite girls can wear large bags and it doesn't have to overwhelm us. It's just about finding the perfect balance with the rest of the outfit so that it complements us instead of taking away from our look. This is something I can wear to an event. If I had a business meeting, I would totally wear it. If I had dinner with my husband, I would wear this as well. So this is a great overall, very versatile outfit. Really quick, I forgot to mention what makes this cardigan so special and it's the fact that it can be worn two ways. So of course you can do it up with the buttons in the front or you can do the buttons off to the side and get an asymmetrical look. This way you're gonna get more of a fitted look and it's still very cool, very La Mer and it drapes beautifully on the body. So this look is inspired by my love of winter whites and minimalism. I'm taking a pair of trousers from Cezanne that are a wool blend, which makes them very warm in the Canadian winters. As you know, it gets really cold up in the north, so I feel like all of these wool blend fabrics are really key to having a really good winter wardrobe. For the t-shirt, I'm going with one from Uniqlo U. This is in a size men's extra small. I just cut it on the bottom to get a cropped look. I'm going with a belt from Koss, and this is from the men's section. I picked it up recently, by the way. And for the shoes, I opted for a pair of Maison Margiela tabby loafers. When it comes to accessorizing my all white looks, I always like to introduce either black or a dark brown. It just creates a nice accent and it helps break up all the white. Another way to break up an all white look is to add an accent color. In this instance, I'm going with a menswear inspired coat. This one is beautifully tailored. It's semi oversized. And by the way, I got this one in a size extra small. It's 90% wool, 10% nylon. The quality is fantastic. I would say that it's right up there with the black coat that I have from Dunst. I find that W Concept has a lot of really beautiful, high quality Korean pieces. So if you're interested in venturing off, trying out some new items, some things that are more contemporary, but still relatively affordable, I'll leave everything in the description box, of course, but let's move on to the next look. Let's move into a casual version of the previous look using a pair of sneakers and a leather bomber jacket. So as you can see, I'm keeping the same pant and t-shirt as before, and then I'm just gonna be layering in a crop cardigan from Koss. This is probably one of my favorite finds from Koss for this season because it's so simple. It looks a lot more expensive than it is considering it's a wool cashmere blend, and it's also incredibly comfortable and not itchy, thank goodness. For the outerwear, I'm opting for my acne bomber jacket. So comfortable. I love the oversized hidden pockets that are inside the jacket because I can put a lot of stuff in there and not necessarily have to have a handbag with me. I did opt for the soft game bag from La Mer. It's nylon, it's comfortable, it's so easy to carry, adjustable, it's absolute perfection. This is an outfit that I recently wore out on the weekends when I was out with my husband. We got up early, we went for a croissant, and we had a nice latte down by the lake. So this is kind of my going out look. Very cozy, very warm, but still casual. I always try to end videos with a dressed up look, and this is what I'm serving you this time around. I love this look because it's tapping into my love of goth. It's tapping into my appreciation of Maria Grazia over at Dior, which to be honest, I've never really been a fan of, but I'm starting to appreciate more and more recently. She did inspire this look. So I have to say, I feel very comfortable, very feminine, but still very much myself. There's an androgynous element coming in from the skirt and the boots. Of course, there's the feminine touch from the shirt and the heart bag adds a little whimsy, which I always love. 
So I'm wearing the Clothes shirt from Cezanne in a size two, which is the equivalent of a size extra small, I would say. Size down if you're thinking about picking up this shirt for yourself because it does run a little bit big. Because the black isn't too sheer, I just wore my strapless bra underneath and it's really not a big deal in my opinion. Of course, if you wanna go for a more modest look, you can always layer a tank underneath. The skirt is a wool blend from Acne Studios and I love the asymmetrical cut on it. I styled it with black leather boots from AD, which are very much giving and Mila Meester vibes and I'm obsessed. For the coat, I opted for a black one just to keep the black on black look. It's more of an elegant holiday going out look. If you watch my videos, I'm assuming that you're like me and you don't like a traditional dressed up outfit where you're wearing heels and a skirt and a dress and everything is skin tight. I definitely like to go for more tailored pieces, pieces that are a little bit more unusual, have some structure and tell a story about my personal style and my personality. So this is my going out look. I hope you like it. I just wanna say thank you everybody for watching my videos. It's always such a joy to read through the comments. I don't always have an opportunity to respond to everybody but I do want to say that I read them all and I appreciate every one of you so much so thank you for watching please subscribe if you haven't already thank you 24s for sponsoring this video make sure you check out the Black Friday sale I will link everything in the description box I'll see you in the next video bye